So it's just boredom? You think boredom. people are bored? It's boredom, and I don't want you to watch me while you're bored. That takes the mystique of power of who you are. Wait a minute, explain that. You don't want people to watch you while they're It's bored. just like specials. That's why I don't care about stand-up specials, because <sighs> it ain't special no more. You watch when you're laying in the bed about to go to sleep. You want people putting on an outfit, going to the movie theater, making an event that's, out of it. That's what made us who we are. That's what made Delirious great. That's what made all the specials great. Even when you watch a When the last time fight. a special changed something? When the last time a special hmm. really... It don't do it no more. It ain't that no more. They're not saying you don't do it. It's, it's like I an think, album. It's like an album. Album don't have the effect it used mm, to do no more. Mm -hmm, you know what I'm saying? So yeah. once I understood that, uh, my specials, I've been putting out specials on Twitter for 15 years. So in all, because what specials did, they gave us gave us um, catchphrases and yeah. gave us shit that, that imp implemented the, the, the culture. Yeah. What I've been doing on social media. Right. So I've been doing it. It's just we programmed to think that's what comedy is and that's what that shit is, but it really ain't. Mm. Like we programmed to think we want to be movie stars because that's what we came up in. That shit been done yeah. 20 years ago. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And I understood that 20 years ago. That's why I never chased that side of the world. Dude, it's so crazy. I was looking at uh, why you chose to get into hip hop videos. Is such an interesting yeah. thing. I didn't know that this was a choice. Mm -hmm. I thought you just kind of like, I don't know, stumbled into it. It's like I understood. But this is a, yeah, can you break down? I understood early this shit is over with, this Hollywood shit. And at that time, too. How did you know? Just paying attention. I mean, what are you seeing? You seeing I'm anything? just looking. It's just like. It's just like now, like people say the world fucked up, but it can't be fucked up. If you look, they still building buildings here, there, there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just money going somewhere. Yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? So it's the same thing in life. So I, I don't pay attention to what people say. I just pay attention to what's going on. What's moving culture. Moving. Or just Because humans, we just talking. But we really are what we are. So if you pay attention to the people's actions, and that's what you'll find out. So that's what I did then. So I just paid. When I went out to L.A. and I started seeing what was going on, like, oh, no, this shit changing. And then the internet started, social media started bubbling at that time. And then it wasn't, and then, too, this was the main thing. TV, it wasn't no black shows on TV no more at that time. Mm -hmm. So this is what? The sitcoms was dying down. So after 2000. UPN 9 kind of started Yeah, it started down. fizzling down. So you start saying, like, where are the black where, people where watching things? There's nowhere for us on this motherfucker no more. And like, then you're like, where are they? Where are they? They're in music videos. Yeah, like, where where is our culture at? And so I'm looking at where it's making the impact. Mm. The impact was in videos. Mm. You see what I'm saying? Like, and if, to this day, shit that's stuck in our head is mostly shit from videos. So I understood that. I was like, shit. I'm right here in the meat of this shit. These motherfuckers love me anyway because most of the most of the rappers they would come to your they show. They come to my stand up shows. Yeah, and so we already had. That's why I came and see. That's another thing too because people start trying to do what I did, but they, same thing with stand up. It was organic, so it works for me. Like it's I am a hip hop comedian, so it works for me. I ain't trying to force it because I seen it work. Mm. Mm. It is me. So I'm saying, yeah. and, it, and it was just time. That's why I say the universe, God. It just all worked at the perfect time. You see what I'm saying? Like, and I just roll with it. I I trust the universe that it's gonna work in my favor. So once I um, understood that, I understood like I'm gonna go where people love me. And I went to Atlanta. I went back to Atlanta. Yeah. And I got on social media. And I that was another thing. When I got on social media, I was like, ain't nobody on this motherfucker yet. Yeah. And I seen this was the beginning. I understood like. This is the future. And and that's when I was like, I can be my own Hollywood right here. Yeah. That's what I understood. This is going to be Hollywood. So I just started focusing on, and then I understood like humans, how their brains work, and their kids. People was kids on social media at first. Like I was programming people how to talk on Twitter because they didn't know or understand how to talk regular on Twitter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It'd be yeah. little shit like that. So I understood my power. Yeah, the only time they'd ever typed anything was like an essay. Yeah. So they like hadn't they typed in colloquial yeah. English. They didn't understand yeah. like how to transfer the dialect, how we talking now yeah, to, to social media. Yeah, it yeah. sounds easy now, but yeah. back then it was like people was really stupid or something. <laughs> you could tell a simple ass joke and this was hilarious. Yeah, yeah, it was go crazy. Yeah. It was like these motherfuckers are kids now. Yeah, yeah. But the difference between me and everybody, like I understood, I didn't use my shit for personal gain 
Because I could have monetized and fucked over people and manipulated the game and became everything y'all seeing, like World Star or all that shit there. But I used it more so to the same thing I used with everything to to help our people get what we are. You know what I'm saying? So, and it, like people say, like they influenced by these other comedians, but if you watch them, all of them follow my blueprint. For example, all I'm just saying as far as. Everything that they successful is, yeah. it's from social media, from yeah. them building that social media yeah, and shit. Yeah, yeah. You see what I'm saying? It ain't from them being a fucking movie star. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Who done made it from being a movie star in the last 10, 15 yeah, years? Yeah, nobody. Hmm. Even I in mean, the white world. I always Even in the white yeah. world. Who done made it? No, you're right. Like they think, like, I always hear say, like, we don't, we, we don't have that much. Um, there's not enough for the black community. It ain't nothing for nobody. Yeah. Everybody fucked up. We yeah. just take it personal because yeah. we go through it. But you, I remember that time you was, when, when, before this shit happened, you was like, man, this shit fucked up out here. I'm struggling. I'm, I don't know where to go. But people don't know that story. Yeah. They don't hear that because they just think all white people got it easy. Yeah. yeah. But he yeah. was like, he didn't know where to fucking go. Yeah. He was still trying to figure it out. But look, yeah. it happened. They only see the success. From because it. of the internet. Because of the internet. Yeah, I just really adopted he created what his you own, were doing. He adopted it and he created it. It's understanding. So, and that's why I get my, my, my. Yeah, man, you would, you would hit me. I, you know, I'd have some show or something like that. And that's another thing that's dope about you. There are certain people that like, they'll be, they'll take somebody's influence. Like I took your influence, right? Mm-hmm. And then when they do something special, instead of feeling good about that, they'll be like angry or jealous. And you, you, people will do that. Yeah, 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 yeah. And like, but you would always, you would always hit me and you'd be like, damn, man, you're making me cry out here in the Bahamas. Or oh, something yeah. like that. Like, yeah, because I, I, I love to see. That's why I do it. That's why I get my satisfaction from. Yeah, it was It really ain't cool. the money. It ain't the success. I've had so much success now. Ain't pretty much nothing left. I, everything you could think you want to do, I did. Yeah. So, I mean, it's just like now I get my, I get my satisfaction out of watching people that. But what a great, like, what a great. Even if they don't give me props, even yeah. if I just like to see it. It's just like yeah. you seeing a kid, like, look at this motherfucker acting like me. <laughs> but isn't that isn't that like a genius move? Like, think about that pivot, right? You go, you go, okay, where is my community? Where are our eyeballs? What are we watching? Oh, we're not watching TV shows because ain't shit out there really for us. Mm-hmm. We're watching music videos, and the music videos are almost our stories. They're our shows. I'm going to integrate myself in this where I already exist. I'm friends with all these guys, and I'm going to be the thing I already am, which is hip-hop comedian. That takes balls. Most people are still trying to chase Hollywood. They're still trying because to chase TV shows. that's what they told. That's, they do what you told. Like, you do what works. But that's genius shit right there. It's sometimes, and you might not credit yourself, but genius is bucking the trend. Genius is doing the thing that nobody wants, wants to, to do or nobody is willing to do. It's sitting right there, and none of us see it. Even though it makes perfect sense. And the but it's, to do it. It, yeah, but it, it just comes from being simple. Simple, like you, I, I understand how to make it simple. However, you want to describe person. it. What I'm saying is, it's a very rare quality. It's easy to be second. It's easy to see someone do it and then do it after them, but it's very hard to be the first person to do it. Yeah, I mean, I ain't the, it's just trailblazing. It's, I mean, it's just being a trailblazer and being an explorer. Like I hate being in a room and and everybody knows something I don't. Yeah. So I've always applied that in me. So it's like if I find out. There's something going on. Like when I get in, when I got into aviation, and I seen that whole world, and I start putting two of them. I'm like, this shit been going on a hundred years. I don't know not one person that really fly for real. Yeah, that's what I'm here for. <laughs> I'm here to show these motherfuckers we can fly. What, what about space? I want to go to space. That's boy. That's my gun. That's, that's the last one. That's right? the last one. I'm a. I can't wait to do the selfie in the world and behind me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm shit on the motherfucker. I might go live. That's when I'm gonna go live. 